Hi guys, it's Sebastian and Kara. Hi. We're back with another video for you today. Today we're going to do a comparison video of Creed's Aventus with Armoff's Club de Nuit Intense for Men. So please stay tuned. Kara and I did a comparison video of Club de Nuit Intense for Women by Armoff with Noir de Noir by Tom Ford. So we've been wanting to do this video for a while now. And finally, I got her here and <laughs> we thought, let's go ahead and do a comparison of The Mighty Aventus with <laughs> everybody's cheap alternative <laughs> Club de Nuit Intense for Men by Armoff. Can you take your arm off? I'm spraying my arm off. <laughs> so are you familiar with these fragrances, Kara? I have some experience with just, you know, just through you, the Aventus, you know. Adventus? Adventus. <laughs> <laughs> Aventus. It's so, a giant pineapple. Giant pineapple? With lots of wood? Yes. A big wood? It's a giant wooden pineapple. Giant wooden pineapple. So I've got my little atomizer here that I use to spray to with. To hold the Aventus. So let's spray Aventus on here. Okay. So Aventus is like a very polarizing scent and a lot of men just find it very easy to wear. So I hear... I feel like everyone likes it. I hear from Neiman Marcus that it's one of their most popular selling fragrances in mm -hmm. the whole department store chain. So Wow. So that's Adventus. Aventus. <laughs> Adventus. And here we go with... As in we're going on a giant Adventus. Adventus. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is really nice. It's very like it's a very it's very well blended. Are we gonna be ba saying bad things about arm off? <laughs> okay, so I didn't want to do this video very quick because even though I enjoyed arm offs, Club de Nuit, the Intense women, Roman, yeah, that one is. I think that one's nice. a okay scent. Mm -hmm. I find the for men, even it's supposedly it's a like a clone of Aventus. It's very Is synthetic. Is it supposed to be a clone? Well, I don't think they intentionally do clones. I think they're trying to make them. I don't know. Maybe right. they do intentionally make them, but... This is very... It's um, not bitter, but sharp in a way that Aventus is not. It's harder to smell, if that makes any sense. Not that it's not strong, but it's just it's like more... Yeah, there's nothing hardly there. Kind of like uh, Otis, uh, Otis, uh, Blue de Chanel, kind of like, kind of like just washed out, kind of hardly anything Aventus. Yeah, I kind of don't, I don't get a lot out of it, but I, do, it is just slightly irritating. To me, it's very synthetic. To my nose, exactly. And hardly anything exactly. there. So. Yeah. It's Aventus light. But it's stronger. It's light, but it's stronger, more intense. Mm -hmm. Is that why it's called Club de Nuit Intense, intense for Men? Yeah. It's very strong. No, I find it very synthetic. That's why I feel like it's sharp. It's, yeah, chemically. Wait, is this event? Is That's Aventus, yeah. yeah. It's fruity. This one is it's fruity and it's like well blended. You can't. It's, it doesn't seem. It's a, it's a decent scent. Yeah. Is it worth the money that they charge for it? Can I say no comment on that? <laughs> <laughs> Would Eric wear this, your husband? I'm not sure. I don't think so. What does Eric like to wear? Eric likes woody stuff, um, but dark. Eric wears whatever I tell him to. It's fine. So you're not going to tell him to wear a Ventus? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, he, he, likes, uh, he likes darker stuff. I mean, he's very his tastes, I think, are very similar to mine. Hmm. He actually picked up my favorite fragrance. So. Oh, what's that? He picked out Rudy's. He was like, we have to get this. Okay. That's a great scent. But going back to Aventus, I think it's a pleasant scent. It is. It's nice. Would you kind of put it in the same category as Sauvage and Bleau de Chanel? Aventus? Yeah. No. Do you find... The There's something different about it. But it is that sort of like, it's a, it's a really nice version of the sort of like Eau de Cologne, like manly sort of scent. But it has a sweetness and a fruitiness that's not present in a lot of traditionally masculine fragrances. Maybe that's why it's I popular. I think that's why it's popular, probably. But 
I don't, I don't find the Club de Nuit Intense for Men very nice. I think it's no, pretty synthetic. No, it's getting bitter, yeah. And there's also a very metallic mm -hmm. vibe. Not vibe, but like a metallicness to it. It's kind of smelling pilly, like pills. Yeah. Maybe that's why it's club. It is it called club. Clubs. Pill pills. popping. Pills, clubs. There we go. I also we find... We figured it out. <laughs> <laughs> I also find these bottles very gaudy. I mean, this is really cheap. If you are on the budget and you don't have money to spend on Aventus, which can cost you quite a penny, this is a good alternative because it's currently selling I, I for about $30. I would not say that it's an alternative at all. That you wouldn't say it? Mm -mm. I don't even see the similarity. Is that bad? That well, yeah, no, it's... Well, yeah, I, it's fine that we don't... we disagree, it's just... We should say that you should buy it? No, I mean, I would actually go right to Aventus and if you can't afford a full bottle, get yourself some decants. But if you really, really cannot do that, this is an okay alternative. Now, I have a better alternative for Aventus. It's called Insurrection Pure 2. To me, it smells the closest to... Who's that by? Um, Rayon. Mm. Not Rayon by the, the material. <laughs> Not Rayon. Rayon, but... <laughs> Rayon. Rayon is R-E-Y. <laughs> it even comes in a really nice package. Uh -huh. But I thought this was really, really metallic. And so many guys came forward and told me, get it, it smells so close to Aventus. And I'm like, that's no. Some, that's really interesting. I don't find that at all. But we really like the one that's for ladies. The Club de Meat Intense for Women was it's really close really to... It's a really good buy for the money. Yeah, oh, that was that a good was buy. Wrong, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but yes. Aventus retails like for 120 mil, I think is the bottle. It retails for about um, 375. I, I could be wrong with the price. Because I don't buy those. And this is the one I bought last. And I think they're not making this size anymore, I was told. This was about 600 something. So, or maybe they are. I can't remember exactly the deals. But I think it was the Spice and Wood. They're not making a certain size of anymore. But, but it is a very expensive fragrance. But I, I enjoy it. Sometimes I don't want intensity. I want a scent. And I would go for something like this. I would wear this over Blue de Chanel and Sauvage and things like that. I could understand why. It's... It's very well put together, and it's not generic smelling. Oh, good. Glad you think it's not generic smelling. <laughs> but this one is pretty generic, right? I wouldn't even call it generic. <laughs> it's, it's, it's like, it's just bitter. Well, it's a bummer. <laughs> See how Sorry, I'm off your it, bummer. <laughs> it came, it, the whole box came like this. It was like, like whoops. falling apart. So it's, the glue's but not even tight there's a on rhinestone it. on the box. So now that's unique. That is unique. That is unique. I do like rhinestones. I don't like them on my perfume, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> rhinestone cowboy? Yes. <laughs> I would take a cowboy hat covered in rhinestones. That's fine. All right. Well, thank you for comparing these. You're welcome. Yeah, I think I would go for the Aventus too. Save up the money and buy decants or buy a bottle. Decants is where it's at, man. Yeah. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching this quick video comparing with. Um, Club de Nuit Intense for Man and uh, uh, Quiz Aventus. We like this one over <laughs> this one. So, but if you must get the Club de Nuit, you can. I'll have links for both below. Thanks so much for watching. Like this video, please share it. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And Kara and I should be back with more videos very soon. Have a good one. Goodbye. Bye.